is a pretty exciting moment. After weeks and weeks of working on the boat to get her ready to go sailing again, we are finally on the move. Yay! <laughs> we're in the Bay of Islands and it is a glorious day and we're actually getting to like get out there, have some fun. Yeah, and not only that, but we're not alone. Well, of course, it's freaking windy. Wave hi to the camera. Hi. We've got Liz and there's Brina. Hello. Joining us for a week in the Bay of Islands. Hi. <laughs> I don't know, girl. Wait, so something a little crazy is about to happen. Oh, gosh. Tell me oh, tell me what you two are doing. Just jumping in the water. No That's deal. all. Just no big deal, except no. the water is freaking freezing. Yeah. No, it's not that cold. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna keep the camera on. We'll find out in about two seconds if it's <laughs> oh, cold God. or not. Okay. Oh, yeah. Where's the sun? It's right there. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait, what? Oh, no, she just went for it. Oh, it's so cold. I had no time to prepare. Like to say that I was vindicated on that one. Yeah, I think they're lying to us. No, thank you. No, no. I'm good. <laughs> we'll take the warmer waters of Tonga or Fiji, huh? Yeah, that sounds like a plan to me. Just kidding. Uh, how was it? Was it cold? A little bit, but not as bad as I thought. It was good. Yeah. After our synchronized swimming routine, which we'll show you later. It warmed up the waters. It did. The rainbow came on The us. rainbow came out. It's pretty good. Yeah, it wasn't bad. You're much braver than I am. David. You should try it, yeah. Nuh uh. Next time. Next sure. Time. Always next time. <laughs> no. We dropped anchor at an island called Motua Rohia, and it was so beautiful that I just had to launch Phoenix to take a look around. Our drone footage revealed a viewing platform on the island, so of course we had to go and search for it. Turns out, it wasn't all that difficult to find. We are on Motua Rohia, or Robertson Island if you're English. Cheating to be able to read the name. Motua Rohia. Motua Rohia. Um, and this is the first site in the Bay of Islands where Captain Cook land, landed. Just like when he right quote unquote away. discovered New Zealand. Yes. Yes. Maori people are a little upset about that <laughs> characterization. Yes, but we're going hiking and we're going... Oh, you can't really see it from up here. But somewhere over there. Yeah. All the way up there. Ready to go. <laughs> we're ready. We're Let's ready. Let's do it. All right. So close to the top. Yeah. yeah. Made it all the way to the top. We made it. Woo. It's a gorgeous view. Yeah. Gorgeous day. Pretty spectacular, New Zealand. I always enjoy envisioning what it must have been like for explorers coming to a new land for the first time. The joy of finally making landfall and the anxiety wondering about relations with the natives. Although 
I'm guessing they didn't spend quite as much time taking selfies. Yay. As it always is, the walk back down seemed a lot shorter, and it felt like in no time at all we were back down at the beach. I know it's irrational, but I always feel a sense of relief seeing that our dinghy hasn't washed away. That night, we had a bug invasion, but fortunately we had a new secret weapon aboard. Die! <laughs> oh my god, watch out. Murder, murder what, what? Us. <laughs> Bug, bug ninja! What, what is she doing over there? She's a mass murderer as, as occurring in your boat right now. These bugs are, have, they have no, no, no future. We're off again. We are off again. You're gonna make me say the name, aren't you? I am. Uru Puka Puka is the island we're going to. Uru Puka Puka. That wasn't too bad. Yeah, not too bad. No. And uh, unfortunately, our poor guests are very stressed out up there. That's very stressful. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to continue doing this without... Clearly we're doing something wrong. <laughs> they didn't seem to be too upset with us, and the wind cooperated enough that we were actually able to pull the Genoa out and do a bit of motor sailing. After so long in the boatyard, this was actually the first chance we'd had to use a sail in quite a while. Okay, we just anchored. Already we have a little bit of excitement. Yeah, yeah that is a lot of sheep. <laughs> yeah, right? We count 15 sheep, sweetie. <laughs> 15 sheep? 15 sheep and one person. One. That two, sounds about three, the four, four, appropriate one. ratio for New Zealand. <laughs> yeah, that's true. 14, 15, 16, 17. Oh, you see more. 18, 18 sheep. Oh my goodness. 19. <laughs> one hiker. <laughs> On an island, of course. 20! Yeah. <laughs> 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. We can all That's a lot of sheep per human. Now we just made it up the beach. Star Horizon's way off there in the distance. And you can kind of see tracks in the beach. Soft sand is a pain in the ass to get the dinghy up. Fortunately, the whole crew helped out. Yeah. Four people, I mean. And now we're ready to go hiking. Uru Puka Puka is well known for having some great hiking trails. So we stocked up with water and snacks and set out to take advantage of another day of great weather. All those sheep Amy saw have to be fenced in, and it didn't take too long to find proof that Amy wasn't hallucinating. So let's see, is this the highest peak in the Bay of Islands? Um, yes. Yeah, I'm I mean, it is. Claiming it now. Yeah, I think it's what it said. It said it was the highest. Nice. All the peaks that we climb will be the highest. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and they will be uphill both ways. You can almost see all of Starry Horizons from here. Is that it? Yeah. Let's yeah. see here. Beautiful view, beautiful view. There she is. That little white dot. <laughs> For those of you wondering, yes, I do live a charmed life, hiking with three lovely ladies. So, you know, Wait, where with the we loops, at? we're over halfway done. Where are we at now? We're here. Oh, the says you're here. We have to go. Um, whatever. If we oh, go wow. straight there, we're over halfway done. Yeah. <laughs> the 
I've done a lot of cool things in New Zealand, but I think this hike is gonna be one of my favorites. Just the Bay of Islands back there is absolutely stunning. It's a beautiful day, clouds, a little bit in the sky, it's kind of warm, but there's a breeze and it's just, it's absolutely incredibly gorgeous. So, in good news, the dinghy's still here. In bad news, the tide went out. A lot. How does that water feel, Brina? Feels better. Yeah? Better. <laughs> For the long hike? I was getting used to it. Very long hike. It's worth it. Actually, it wasn't that long. We Only a couple it. hours. We picked a medium length one. Oh, it feels good now. You should probably... If you toss me that camera, I'll, I'll get you uh, jumping in. No, that ain't gonna happen. Are you getting in as well? I am. We're all hot and sweaty and gross. And instantly cool and... Clean-ish. And salty. Yeah. Ah, I hate the first jump in. Ah. Boom! <laughs> Woo! Oh my god! <laughs> it's cold. Feeling better. Oh yeah. Um, it feels good right now, but I can see in like two minutes it's gonna be way too cold. <laughs> and then there were three. Isn't it colder? I feel like it's colder than the other place. Yeah, it's much colder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it feels good. I don't regret every decision I've made. <laughs> yeah, those three are crazy. <laughs> but it feels so good after the hike. Yeah. I don't buy it. That night, the ladies wanted to try their luck at fishing, so we dug out our casting rods from deep storage and let them have at it. What if I just like flung this into the ocean? <laughs> hey, that nice job! That was a good one! Nice! Sorry, okay. I know I'm blinding you if you look Flip at me. Flip it up, there we go. Zippity doo da. Got it on there. <laughs> Play with it. Jump, jump, jump. Come here! <laughs> grab it, grab it, grab it! Oh god! Oh, it's pretty small. Just grab it. Liz, well done! Oh, god, fish! Yeah, he got the run. What is that? Yeah, he's got I'm spikes kidding. on him. Oh. It's a little snapper. Oh my god, look at you! <laughs> Liz, how do you feel? I feel really good. Alright. Uh, oh god. We're gonna let him go, right? If that's what you want to do, sure. Enjoy your life. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> when Liz and Brina's time was up, we took them back into Paihea and got a bit of an escort along the way. What did we find though? Dolphins! Dolphins? Yeah! Dolphins! Hey, they now the right trip's complete, here. huh? Yes. <laughs> With the appearance of the dolphins, there was only one thing remaining that we needed to do before we could let the girls leave. Is that the world famous New Zealand hokey pokey ice cream? It is. Yes, or as Liz mm. likes to call it, the hanky tank. Hanky panky, hokey pokey. It's all about same, the same, same right? Same, same, but different. <laughs> same, same, but different. Mm -hmm. Nice. Delicious. Has crunchy, crunchy and honeycomb. Honeycomb, honeycomb. Mm -hmm. and vanilla ice cream. Very good. Those no. Kiwis know how to do ice cream, don't they? Yes. Mm. You can say goodbye now. They have to leave us. This is your Man. It's been a great trip. Yeah. Yeah. Now we're sad. Off to the city. I hope it's a good wine. The yeah. wine festival, you're going to suffer. Wine, yeah. The wine festival. <laughs> oh, yeah. Taking a ferry to Wiki Island for a wine festival. It'll be great. Yeah. Well, it was great to have yeah. you guys. Yeah. Yeah. So Thanks much. for coming and everything. Yeah. 
Hey everyone, hope you enjoyed our long-awaited return to the cruising lifestyle. I know I certainly did. I want to send a huge thanks to Liz and Brina for being a little flexible with your schedules. I had to do a little rescheduling at the last minute. Uh, if you guys stick around for more videos, we've got maybe a couple left in New Zealand, and then we make a break for Tonga. That's Tonga. So uh, it's going to be pretty awesome. Stick around, check it out. Thanks for watching, everyone.